welcome back to our third segment uh, which is moral stories uh, in this segment uh, Molana Fahad uh, would be telling us a very interesting and listenable story uh, from the past so Molana you're on uh, well we, we are in the month of Muharram so this is a very appropriate story uh, according to this month of Muharram okay. this is about Shah Abdul Aziz Dehlvi rahimahumullah ta'ala who is the older son of uh, Shah Waliullah mm -hmm. and Shah Waliullah rahimahumullah ta'ala he is a saint of his time okay and he is the main reason for which the ilam of tafsir and ilam of hadith came into the subcontinent okay if you know that if somebody says that he has learned the ilm of hadith he cannot have learned it without having Shah Waliullah in the chain of the teachers that he right. has right in the same way is the ilam of tafsir. So Shah Waliullah is a great man. And his son, Shah Abdul Aziz Dahilvi rahimahullah ta'ala, was a very wise man and a very knowledgeable scholar of his time. And people, this was the time when uh, in this British people, there was a time of British rule okay. in subcontinent. Okay. So people were getting affected by the propaganda and they were getting intimidated by this new religion of Christianity. And people would put doubts. And he would go out and debate with people to, conf uh, to remove the doubts mm -hmm. from, the brain, uh, from the minds of the people. So he had a very interesting debate with a, uh, with a Christian uh, faith leader, some minister. A minister told uh, Shah, uh, Shah Abdul Aziz Muhaddis Delvi rahimahullah ta'ala that you say that Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa your Nabi Muhammad, is the mahboob of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he is the friend of Allah, he is the most favorite of Allah than any other prophets, mm -hmm. right? So why did Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did not protect his grandson when his grandson Imam Hussain radiallahu anhu was, uh, was mercilessly, he was brutally martyred in the yes. uh, battle of yes. Karbala, very true. which happened in the month of uh, Muharram that we are in. Yes. It's a very sad reality that the grandson of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is martyred and he was not even given a drop of water to drink. Right, right. So Shah Abdul Aziz Delvi rahimahumullah ta'ala says that our, so he, he, the, the minister says that why your prophet did not request Allah that to save his grandson. Yes. So Shah Abdul Aziz uh, says that yeah he did. He did request to Allah. Then the minister said then what happened? He said, uh, uh, then he said, then Allah said that I could not have saved my own son. So how could I have worried about, you? how could I have done a favor to your grandson? Yeah. Because according to Christians, they believe that Jesus is the son of Allah. Right. Is the son of God. <laughs> yeah. So the God says, I could not have helped my own son when he was put, in, put on the cross by Jews, Jewish yeah. Uh, yeah. people. So how could I, have, uh, how can I help your grandson when I'm unable to help my own people, right. my own son? Right. So now the, that rabbi, uh, the minister, he got his idea, he got his answers. Yeah, yeah. That this is not how you, uh, uh, this is not how you uh, conclude. Yeah. If Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has not, has not done anything, doesn't mean that he's not able to, or does not mean that Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa is not his favorite. Right. It just means that there are other wisdoms or there are other aspects in the, uh, in the event that are more important and more critical. Yeah. So... Uh, this is one of the stories that how Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave wisdom to our, uh, our, our ulama. Wonderful. Thank you so very much. The this, this story was, was outstanding, interesting, and what should, it, it, it puts thoughts in my mind also. Uh, but, you know, uh, the time is up for our show. Uh, so so uh, we would like to thank you once again for being on our show. Uh, we would like to thank you very much also uh, for watching our show. Um, uh, we hope that, that you liked our show. We would like you to give uh, us your opinion about this show. Give us suggestions, give us comments, uh, give us questions. Um, until next week, uh, Allah Hafiz, take care of yourself. Assalamu alaikum.